you doing? I'm doing just fine. This is Modernly Kitchen, aka your favorite couple in the kitchen. Give you guys keys to keep your kitchen blessed with no stress. You don't walk in this kitchen and leave out with stress. That's not what we do. We make you happy, even if you don't want to be. It's not a choice. Ain't that right, babe? Show it. That's right. So today, guys, we have a treat for you with a, another kitchen tech review over something most people would consider a treat, and that's, of course, Kirstie's favorite pastime, drinking wine. Why? Why, are you, why do you do this? Like, I'm trying to film. I'm not trying. I love the energy. Keep the enthusiasm, all right? But people might think you're alcoholic, and we don't want that. <laughs> but yes, guys, we're talking about wine. Amazing ingredient in a lot of Chef Kirstie's cooking that she uses sometimes sparingly in her uh, searings of like different meats and everything like that to help bring out that flavor. And also time to little kick back a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So you can get that goodness, that moistened goodness within your body. Quench your thirst. Succulate on succulent berries. I came up with that. We're gonna patent that word. Succulate on succulent berries. Tell me how you like that. I don't. Suc you, don't, you don't like it? I don't even know what succulate means. Is that in the dictionary? I made up a word, that's how dope it is. But with that said, nothing is worse than coming into your kitchen, getting that new bottle of wine and realizing it got a cork and you got no cork open. On today's Modern League Kitchen Tech Review, we are going over an automated cork opener that's helping you get to that succulent, savory, succulent berries. Yeah, I used it again. With this bad boy right here, the Houdini wine opener. Dude, we like to go over the pros, we like to go over the cons, we like to go over the usage as well as give you a demonstration on how this bad boy works on whether or not should you buy it. I don't know, should you? Time to find out. The Houdini wine opener is a clutch addition to any kitchen and is a great alternative to the carpal tunnel inducing sweat curdling contraption that is this son of a bitch. It's great for all types of corks including synthetic and even gets through wine foil at the top for easier access to that sweet nectar. It has an electric corkscrew that lets you lock it on the bottle for easier operation. Simply press the down arrow to remove the cork and then press the up arrow to eject the cork. So simple a baby can do it. No, seriously, she tried. This toddler is causing us a lot of problems. It's made of stainless steel and literally weighs like nothing at all, so you don't have to worry about throwing out your bag. With the sleek design, it fits well into any aesthetic of any kitchen and is easy to clean with a simple damp wipe. But do not put it in the dishwasher, I swear to God. One thing that is a bit annoying about it, however, is that it's pretty loud for such a small contraption. Also, when using it on the cork, there are times where you'll have locked it on and press up, but the cork just comes halfway off. So you have to do it again. It usually works on the second time, but still, I gotta expose them. You know, I gotta expose them. It currently retails for around 18 bucks, depending on where you get it. Link below in the description you know we got you dog all right guys so now we're on to the demonstration portion of this video i'm gonna go ahead and give you guys an inside look on exactly how to use this bad boy this guy right here boom boom all right guys, so now we have our wine here. Winking Owl Merlot, cheap, we keep it cheap. Look, don't judge us, just for demonstration purposes. Now the awesome thing about the Houdini, you actually don't even have to remove the aluminum film on the top in order to penetrate the cork and pull it back out. But for the purposes of this video, we're gonna go ahead and just remove that. All right, now that our cork is exposed to the world, we're just gonna use the Houdini and place it right on top. As you can see, you can see the cork right in there, cork screw. All right, we're just gonna put it right on top and kind of firmly press down while pressing the down button. And you're gonna hear a pop. a light pop <laughs> once it's been fully fastened and secured on there you want to just press up just hold down the up button pull out and as you can see we got a cork right here magic boom no hassle no running around your house trying to find a corkscrew no trying to use fangled tricks that you see on youtube with a shoestring and a nickel simple because that's what we do at Marley kitchen we keep it simple God damn right. Only one thing left to do now, guys, and that is to pour us up some nice cold glasses of wine. Turn on some Netflix and enjoy the evening. There you guys have it. Left for you to enjoy. I'm surprised you to finish the whole cup. I was trying to be a baby. Trying to <laughs> Now let's review. On the positive end, it's convenient, has a sleek design, it's very lightweight, easy to lock on the bottle, easy to clean, and it's easy on them damn wallets, and it's very simple to use. On the negative end, eh, it can get loud sometimes, and sometimes it doesn't get the cork all the way out. Overall, like I said before, it's a great pickup, man, and honestly, there's no problems with it too much, and it does the job as intended. So, it's gotta get that approved. There you have it, ladies and gents, the full overview review of the Houdini wine opener. You know it's got to give that Marley Kitchen stamp 
of approval. If you guys liked this video, you thought it was helpful helping you with your own decisions, whether or not you should buy it, please leave a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe and do not forget to follow us at the followings that you see below at the end of the screen. This has been your boy Izzy with Modern Lake Kitchen and as always, stay blessed, don't stress. Thank you guys so much for watching our channel. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button and don't forget to tap the bell icon so you never miss another video. Also in the midst of getting your kitchen blessed with no stress, why not bless yourselves with some awesome gear? Check out our Martin Lee Kitchen store for some awesome t-shirts and aprons. Get you set right. Do it for the culture.